Today I received a phone call from someone who was looking to rent one of my privately owned properties. And one of the questions that she had for me is, why do private landlords charge so much for a security deposit? And I explained to her a couple of things from my own experience and perspective as a private landlord. First of all, apartment complexes, they have their own in-house resources to turn the property around whenever somebody moves out. So they've got their carpet people, their window cleaning people, their house cleaning people, whatever, that's all in-house and they can do it very quickly. As a private owner, I do have all those contacts, but I need to reach out to each of them individually and schedule things based on their schedule. And it might take a while to actually get the property ready to re-rent. The other thing is that there's concern about you know, damage to the unit and making sure that there's enough money to make any repairs necessary to the property should any damage occur. Sadly, there are instances where this happens and I'm gonna show you a few pictures here of an instance where on one of my properties I had to actually do an eviction and this was the condition of the property uh, when I arrived after the sheriff asked them to leave. And yes, that is dog poop that you see on the floor. Um, these people were living in, in this place and did a lot of damage. And in this case, the amount of security deposit I had, although it was substantial, wasn't enough to cover the damage that they did to the property. So there is concern from private landlords about who's gonna be in their unit and wanting to make sure that it's somebody that's financially stable and also, you know, should something happen, that there's money to cover it. Was As I was talking to her, I thought, you know, she's probably not the only one that has this question about the security deposit. So I thought I'd do a quick video and just kind of share with you guys what goes on in the mind of a landlord uh, when they're renting out their private property. So hopefully that you found that helpful. If I can help you in any other way with real estate questions, feel free to reach out to me. My name is Adrienne Marks and I'll talk to you soon.